Tyler Smith alongside Tom Seib reporting for Tap and a Greater Orleans, and we're here to report Siena College's Research Institute poll has just been released as asking voters from New York a variety of questions, and one that we tended to report on here is New York State is contributing $600 million toward the building of a new stadium for the Buffalo Bills, and Tom, overwhelmingly, the vote came to be disapproving the funding for the new stadium. What yeah, do you mean, think about the numbers? Yeah, I mean, in all honesty, I didn't think it was too much of a shock. I mean, obviously, when you see a number um, of a value that high, um, you know, obviously, you know, taxpayers will not want, um, you know, that, obviously. So, you know, I, I think it, it was interesting to see the different categories, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, both... It was pretty much nose across the board. Yeah, you know, no matter the political affiliation, um, you know, whether you're from New York City or upstate... Male, female. Yeah, I mean, it was kind of all, you know, like you just said, across the board, all no's. So mm -hmm. it, was, it was interesting to see, but in all honesty, I don't see it as a, as a shock. Some more things I didn't see shocking as well. Obviously, male versus female, 32% uh, approved it to, to 57 to no. And then for females, 17% approved it to 69% no. Because you know, we obviously know the NFL is, is a male-dominated fan base, and, and that, that makes a bit of sense. But you know, like you said, no matter the political affiliation, race, uh, region, if it was New York City, suburbs, upstate, uh, ethnicities, uh, it, it really didn't matter. Ages, and that's another thing that didn't really surprise me as well, is the uh, 18 to 34 range was by far the most uh, approving age group of them all. But even then, that they, they're still the overwhelming majority there. 55 to 32 was, was disapproving uh, the, bill, the the funding of, of the stadium. So it, it's just pretty interesting to see income. Uh, religion didn't matter as well. It, it, every, everybody across the board uh, overwhelmingly is, is disapproving of this. And this, like you said, because of the tax dollars involved, and, and it's not going to be coming right from New York State's budget. It's going to be coming from the people who live in, in the state. So very interesting to see. Uh, we have a conversation with Senator George Borrello to see his comments uh, tomorrow, and we'll be releasing some more updates about it as the day goes on. Uh, Tyler Smith, Tom Seth for Tapping a Great Only, and just get your news here.